Thank you. First off, I'd like to um, thank the Manitoba Sports Hall of Fame as well as um, ABM Concrete for making this night possible. I'm truly honored to be inducted into the Manitoba Sports Hall of Fame. And this night has become really special because it's being held in the town in which I was born and raised, Selkirk, Manitoba. If any of you know golf or have played golf, you know that it's a very selfish sport, very individual. And unlike team sports, we really, obviously we don't have teammates, but we don't have anybody to kind of fall back on, rely on. We don't have that support team. After my first year or two of professional golf, I realized that I needed to lean on my support team and realize who my support team was. And that first off being um, my family. Of course we have, as professional golfers, we have swing coaches and sports psychologists and trainers. They're important, yes, but they're nowhere near as important as friends, family, and fans. To start with, uh, my mom and dad, who obviously were there from the beginning, from the first time I picked up a club, were very supportive. My dad's not here with us anymore, but I know he's looking down right now and is very proud of this moment. Um, again, from the first time I picked up a club, they were very supportive. All the way through till the end of my career, they did so much traveling over 16 years of professional golf. Um, well, they had a lot of frequent flyer miles. My brothers, their families, uh, same thing. Uh, Canadian Opens, they came down to the States a few times to, uh, to watch. All through my career, very supportive. Their sons, daughters, same thing. On to my wife and my two daughters, my wife Julia, my two daughters Eileen and Morgan. Uh, my two daughters basically grew up traveling. From the time they were six weeks old, they started traveling. My wife, um, who is a saint, uh, as you all know that golf isn't really conducive to the family life with all the traveling and she made, uh, she made life normal for us as much as possible. Uh, doing odd jobs out on, uh, out on the road and um, actually caddying for me early on in my career. Next are the friends and fans. Growing up in Selkirk, we had a fantastic junior program that um, I was fortunate enough to go through, being mentored by Gordon Linton, Wayne Sutherland, Kenny Peterson. Gordon Linton at, sitting at the table right over there with his wife Edie, Wayne Sutherland, and uh, some of the Sutherlands are here at one of the tables. Um, they were huge in my development as a junior player. As I went through the ranks, got a little bit older, um, I played at Pine Ridge a little bit, and. Uh, you know, gained some friendships there and, and they also had an impact on my career and there's also a table from Pine Ridge over there behind that pole. Um, Manitoba Golf Association, uh, a, a place where I would honed my skills and was able to play nationally before I went off to college. When I speak of fans, I don't really want to say fans because I don't see myself in that light, but people who come up to me over the course of my career and would congratulate me or encourage me on playing better, whether it's playing good or bad, they always had something good to say. It's still evident today when I had an older gentleman in front of my mother's building this morning come up to me and ask me if I was Glenn Natchik and, and congratulated me on being inducted into the Manitoba Sports Hall of Fame and then quickly went to, what do I need to work on in my setup? Can I change my grip? What do I need? This is a true story. <laughs> uh, but seriously, that it's just, it just shows how, how much support I had over my career. And this is seven years after I was done playing, or I'm done playing golf and, and, and I still get it. So um, I'm very proud to be able to represent Selkirk, Manitoba, Canada in that fact, and without 
my support team, I never would have been close to the successes that I'd had. In closing, I'd like to, in closing, I'd like to congratulate the other inductees on their accomplishments, and um, once again, thank you.